concern now is I'm going to be retiring soon. My, my concern is Medicare and Social Security. But I'm also concerned about affordable care, health care. And I think the recent bill that was proposed was an abortion. To not do a point, but I think it was ridiculous. So here's my question. There's going to be um, a proposal by uh, Senator Sanders. Um, Supposedly it's coming up later this month. It's basically single payer. I, I don't know the details of it. I've read how he feels about things, so I have an idea. And you probably don't know the details either. I but, don't. But my question is, how, how are you going to help support single payer? Because all of the proposals and the reworks that have been coming up with health care right now basically are just helping the health insurance industry. People like me, people like my children, and the healthcare people who provide healthcare, the doctors and the uh, medical facilities, the nurses, etc., are not getting any breaks. But the healthcare industry is getting all the breaks. So my question again, how are you going to help support single payer healthcare? Well. going to mean complete takeover by the government of all health care. Yes. If single payer health care means trying to work out some of the problems that are existing. We've got an immediate problem that I learned about just coming up. It's a cost responsibility um, issue uh, and that there was a house um, court case and the House won the court case. And this is going to cost insurers in a month $7 million for 6 million people who get extra help between $11,000 a year and $29,000 a year. This may be what Trump is waiting for, to show that this program can fall apart, at least the individual premium part of the program. Um, the Commonwealth, um, what's the name of the uh, group that just sent the memo? I have it here, I just saw it last night. It, uh, I can get it for you. Yeah, I think it's a very important memo. I'd like you to take a look at it and get back to me on it because um, Trump may refuse to pay this, which means that six million will get dropped if insurers quit. It's something that's out of the blue. I did not know that there was suit against it. And I did not know that the House won the suit on the first level. Single so it's going to be, this is the existential domestic issue, no question about that. That and climate change are the two big issues that we have to face this year. And we have to pass a bill to deal with that. Neither is easy. Question on that side? Okay, next question.